It's the Tony Rose Morning Show on G93. And uh, coming up here in just a little bit, just a few days away, Wednesday, March 8th, you got a chance to be a part of something very, very special right here in Bowling Green as the one and only NASCAR legend. You know him, the one and only Kyle Petty is coming to town on a motorcycle as part of a very special ride back again this year. It's Kyle Petty's charity ride across America, the 28th anniversary of it. We are joined by the one and only Kyle Petty right now on D93. Good morning, sir. How you doing? Doing great. How about you? I tell you, man, we are tickled to have you coming through Bowling Green as part of this tour that you guys are going on to celebrate and raise funds for uh, Victory Junction, this uh, charity ride across America coming up uh, in May, May 4th through the 10th. Kind of tell us about... Uh, tell us about what you got planned uh, as we head towards uh, the month of May. So we leave May 4th from uh, Deadwood, South Dakota. We go down to North Platte, um, Nebraska, and then over to Omaha, and then over to Bettendorf, Iowa, where we're staying on the Mississippi River. And we are, then we go from there to Indianapolis, last the racetrack. We're having lunch at uh, Churchill Downs. Wow. And then we're coming to you. The National Corvette Museum, man, and we're so excited to come there. We're going to have a special guest with us. Can't tell you who it is yet, but we have a special guest, other than the advertised guest that we have. Then we're going from um, from there over to Bristol, Tennessee, and then to to the camp, to Victory Junction, a camp that we founded 20 years ago, uh, or that's been open 20 years. Uh, it was founded in memory of my son, Adam, who was killed in a racing accident in 2000. So uh, that's what we do. That's what the ride's all about. This is our... Amera Icon Ride. We looked at Rushmore as being iconic, Indianapolis Motor Speedway, the Mississippi River, the Corvette oh, yeah. is iconic, the iconic sports car, Churchill Downs, and then uh, Bristol, Tennessee, the fastest half mile in the world. <laughs> a lot so, of speed. Uh, those are our iconic visits that year. That's right. A lot of speed on this year's tour, for sure. Um, now, how often, how often do you get to this area, down into the uh, Kentucky area, and of course into the especially here in Bowling Green, around the Corvette world. Do you get a chance to go out there much? When was the last time you were, you were out at the Corvette Museum in the Corvette plant area? So I, I, can't, I can't divulge everything because legally I'm not supposed to come back to the state of Kentucky. Whoa, uh, okay. No, okay. That's, I kid. I kid. <laughs> so I have, I have some friends, George and Dee Cable, yeah. uh, and that, we've been up there two or three times with them to pick up Corvette uh, there at the museum. We were just there last November. Uh, t- doing a tour and getting our site inspection all, all, all filled out. So, listen, I've been on the track across the street. I've been uh, been through the museum a million times, it feels like. I-, I will tell you this. I've bought a million souvenirs there. I've got more Corvettes <laughs> in my house that my little boys play with uh, that I bought right there at the museum. So, it, And they love that place. And that is what is so cool. It doesn't make any difference whether you're five years old or whether you're 85 years old, that the, the National Corvette Museum is an amazing place. Uh, of course, you're going to be here in Bowling Green, like I said, on Thursday, um, or, I'm sorry, Wednesday, uh, May the 8th, is when you guys get in Bowling Green, then you head out on May the 9th, so you'll be here for that. Folks can come out, get their picture made, learn about uh, learn about the ride, learn about Victory Junction, learn about everything, right? Just It's, it's a real uh, interactive experience for not only NASCAR fans, but uh, Cal Petty fans, and, and just overall, uh, just people in general who want to be part of their community? Listen, that most definitely. You know, it, the, the ride is about giving back. That's what it's all about. But, yeah. you know, when we come through the – we've seen kids at, at camp from all 50 states, from four, four, four or five foreign countries. We've seen 125,000 kids totally free of charge at Victory Junction. It's for children with serious medical needs and chronic medical conditions. Um, and that's why we're able to attract. My dad's coming with us. Richard Petty will be wow. there. Herschel McGriff. Uh, a NASCAR Hall of Famer who started racing back in the, in the early 50s. He'll be with us. Kenny Schrader, Kenny Wallace, Max Pappas, David Reagan, uh, Herschel uh, Walker, okay. NFL superstar. Uh, so if you like football, come on out and talk to Herschel Walker. He's got a Heisman Trophy with him. He'll, he'll say hello. Uh, but we've got some celebrities with us. Rutledge Wood, Top Gear America, man. He's, uh, he'll be there with us. So And like I said, and we've got a couple of other special guests. Uh, that we're not going to announce yet, but we're really excited to have them at the Corvette Museum. So they're all going to be on the ride with you from from start to finish. They're going to be out there on the road with you, riding the bikes and telling stories and meeting the yep. meeting the folks throughout across the country. Yeah, every time we stop at a fuel stop, we sign autographs, we take pictures. They're they're with us the whole way. Uh, I've got ankle bracelets on all of them, so they can't escape, <laughs> even though they try. So uh, <laughs> again, I'm kidding, but but they are just. I mean, it's it is so much fun to have to have a Kenny Wallace and to have a Kenny Strader and to have a Richard Petty. 
oh, uh, yeah. th- th- to be on the ride with us. And, you know, it, it, you just attract so much attention. And uh, that brings attention to Victory Junction and the camp. So that's what this is all about. If people want to study up on Victory Junction, of course, they've heard the name. NASCAR fans, we got so many of them, they know the story. But if they really want to learn more about the story, what's the best way? Uh, what's the website? Best way to find out more about Victory Junction and what you guys do for them? Yeah, go to victoryjunction.org. And if you know a child uh, that could benefit from a champ, uh, camp like this, once you're, you're on the website, please uh, call the number that's listed. Uh, give us their name and their contact. We'll get in touch with them. It's totally free to their parents, totally free to all kids. But it's victoryjunction.org uh, to find out where the ride's coming through because we may be coming right through your neighborhood, whether you like it or not. <laughs> we may come right by your house. To find out what the route is and where we're stopping for fuel and what we're doing, you can follow us on KylePettyCharityRide.com. I, I think they'll know when you're there, when you're rolling to town. I think they're going to be able to hear it coming on down the road. Either that or it's a thunderstorm, one of the two, you know, as you guys make your way yeah, in sure, there. For sure. Uh, it's a pleasure. Sure. You're a great ambassador to not only the sport of NASCAR, but to the community in this country as well. Uh, you're a national treasure, Kyle Petty. We appreciate you so much for joining us, and we can't wait to see you in a couple of weeks here in Bowling Green as part of the uh, big 28th annual Cal Petty Charity Ride Across America. It's good to talk to you again, my friend. Thank you. Can't wait to get there.